Oh, unlimited energy, ah. I'm liking the unlimited energy. Hey there everybody and welcome to the demo of Val Ferris. This is a uh, 2D action platformer, in this case it's a science fiction uh, mixed with some heavy metal inspiration as you can tell by the soundtrack hopefully. Uh, this is made by the same developers who created Slain Back From Hell which was also uh, heavy metal inspired, however it was set in more of a uh, Norse mythology kind of setting. In this case they've gone full on sci-fi which I really like, uh, one of my favorite genres. Ooh, the shield. See, science fiction, shields. I mean, we have a laser sword, we have a shield, we have a pistol as well. Um, very interesting to see uh, how they've improved on the uh, previous game in the series. Let's see, here we go. Oh, heart, yes, okay, so full health. Oh, very visceral combat as well, as you can tell. Very sort of gore, which I really like. Oh, we can actually crouch. Hey, I blew your legs off. Oh. Ah. Oh, you can grab onto things in this one. That's new. Hey, little doggos. No, bad doggo. Bad doggo. There we go. Oh, I thought I got you, but I didn't. Oh. I was a big fan of the original. Uh, it's good to know that they've actually kept sort of the basic style of the original game while uh, transferring it obviously to a whole new setting. Oh, and you activate checkpoints this time. That's new. Down in space to drop. Oh. Ah. Okay, good to know they've added a bunch of new mechanics here. Oh, Ooh, I sliced your head off. <laughs> ah. Let's get that little gem here, whatever it is, in order to use it for the next checkpoint. Ah. Uh, these little blue power-ups here that seem to be... Uh, flocking to us as we kill enemies with the sword here, are actually to recharge our energy, which I think is expended while using a shield, maybe? I'm not actually not quite sure how it's expended quite yet, but I'm sure we'll find out. Whoa! Okay, are these like infinitely spawning enemies or something? Because, uh... Ah! Oh! <laughs> uh, you really die do die in the most visceral ways in this game. This is actually part of the fun. Try to get that checkpoint at least, which will fully heal your character. Always good. Uh oh, it's like a mini boss. All right, hop up here. Avoid the laser beam. Drop down here. Okay, not too bad so far. Hey, you did. All right. I really hope that, like in the original, when you defeat a level, you can have the option to uh, headbang to celebrate your victory. Which I thought really just added a lot of flair to the game as well, and really suited the style. I mean, it is heavy metal after all, so what's heavy metal without a headbang here and there? Oh wait, I cut your head, I cut your torso off, and your legs continued walking. That's so cool. <laughs> oh, all right. Let's get a checkpoint here. Uh oh, uh oh. Wait, can I go down here? I can. Uh oh. Oh, I thought I destroyed you. There we go, got it, okay. Well worth coming down here for the little bit of extra damage we took. Oh, whoa, whoa, what the? Oh, ow. Okay, I think you're actually supposed to shoot them, but I just ran past them. Ow! It's a trap, it's a trap! Oh. <laughs> it's got my torso bitten off by an hungry, I don't know, cyber wolf, it looks like. What are you? Whoa. Whoa. What the? Wow, that was a cyber... Mega cyber wolf. Cyber dire wolf? I don't know. Whoa. Okay, let's grab this heart, because we desperately need the health. There we go. Okay, 
Come on, little platform. Ain't got all day. I'm really glad to see a lot of enemy variety in the demo so far. Um, it actually seems to be... Uh, I don't know if there's a lot of content. Ooh, a weapon. What's this? Hey, there's the headbang. <laughs> Hellwraith. Yeah, let's equip it now, sure. Oh, it's like a minigun. Oh, so cool. Oh, ah, so there's the energy. Okay, so these platforms you gotta shoot for a temporary uh, lifting of the gate there. We will do that to attach the little component there. Oh, no. Oh, that actually worked. All right, let's get down here before we die. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Okay, glad to see the gameplay is actually quite tricky. Same as it was with the original uh, Slain Back From Hell as well. Oh, these ships actually kill you. Oh no. <laughs> I didn't know. Alright, alright. Hey, we did it. Nice. Okay, checkpoint. Please checkpoint and please health. Oh, blood metal. Can increase the power of your weapon. Ah. Okay, so this is new. If we're near a checkpoint here, we can press P and we can. Ah, we can upgrade our pistol and our weapons and our sword. Very cool indeed. Can't wait to do that. Do some more damage, perhaps? This way. There we go. Ooh, creepy little spider things. They don't seem to be attacking you, they just kind of walk in a straight line, and I assume they hurt you if uh, they walk into you, but let's try to avoid that. Ow. I guess they do. Let's kill all the nasty beasties. There we go. go down here. Oh, checkpoint. Nice. Oh, blood metal. Excellent. That's two out of three we need. Then we'll find another one. What's this? Oh, I meant source of energy ahead. <laughs> Alright. Oh, unlimited energy. Ah. I'm liking the unlimited energy. <laughs> Your battle shot levels are over 9,000. <laughs> Alright. Quite the rush, yes, indeed. Ah, path forward is blocked by debris. I think we need to find the power cell for the ship here. Uh, standing on... Yeah, lack of fuel crystal. There we go. So we need to get the ship operational. And I think that's going to do it for this part one of the Valferis demo playthrough. Hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, please feel free to leave a like, comment, as well as consider subscribing if you like this kind of content and you'd like to see more. We'll see you again soon.